Hey everyone, it's Jack Fuki again. I'm back with another 1500 scale airliner review. Today we're going to be looking at the Herpa Condor Boeing 757 330WL. This is Herpa catalog number 518536. And this one also comes in the peanut or peanuts colors, the Snoopy peanuts. Um, it is a 2011 release, limited production. Um, it is named Woodstock, and the registration is B-ABOJ, and it is powered by two RB211-535E4B engines. In other words, Rolls-Royce engines. But let's take a look at the box here. Uh, this one did come with a, a section of ground foil. As, they, as you can see in there, um, there's a Linus. Peppermint Patty. Snoopy in his World War I flying gear with Woodstock. There's Charlie Brown. <coughs> Sides of the box have pretty much the same stuff. There's Lucy. Franklin with Woodstock, there's Sally, and there's those people. <laughs> That's a dog, call them a people. Anyway, there's the same stuff up there, picture of the real plane, limited edition, measurements of the real plane, <clears throat> and of course Peanuts by Schultz. Charles Schultz being the guy who created Snoopy and Charlie Brown. And there is the plane. Now this is the stretch version of the 757. And when I first got it, um, as, as much as I'm into, you know, into airplanes and so forth, I didn't even really, didn't even really put two and two together. I mean, I thought, oh crap, did they just send me the wrong scale? I felt like an idiot because it's like, no, that's just a stretched version of the plane. But, it'll focus here. See all the markings on there. Got Linus with his blanket trapped in the door. Serves him right. Got the winglets. There's Lucy, Peppermint Patty. Sally Franklin Charlie Brown sticking his head out of the door actually it looks like he got his head slammed in the door the website Thomas Cook who owns Condor Lufthansa used to own Condor but no longer oh yeah it wouldn't be a complete video if you know, without the dogs in the background, the neighbor's dogs. Same stuff on this side, except you've got everyone going in through the front. You gotta be careful with this one too, by the way. I've had the wheels come off. The landing gears have come off. Or the uh, wheels themselves have come off. But there's all the uh, cargo doors there. Not so great job on the engines. It's flat on the exhaust, but it's okay. I'll live. But yeah, you really do need to be careful with these front gears because they're a they're flimsy, and um, those wheels just don't stay on too well. I've I've kind of had the same problem with like the um, what's his name the I'll spit it out here in a minute. Uh, what is it the A three twenty one duh yeah there we go. But um, that should do it for this one. 
hopefully I'll feel a little bit better in the next video but uh, <clears throat> don't forget to comment rate subscribe I know I, I didn't sound all excited during this video but yeah just I all those times where I was saying oh yeah my throat's giving me problems well I finally got sick so um, as you'll see in the Kalula 737 video yeah I, I said that I had gotten sick that's why I haven't been posting any videos but um, I just did two of them so <laughs> there you go uh, don't forget to comment rate and subscribe and I'll see you guys later